Hello everyone and welcome back to the new video of Educate WordPress. On this channel, we talk everything about WordPress. And today, we are gonna see a plugin that can help you customize the product page and many more things in WooCommerce and in Elementor and in Gutenberg. With the help of a single plugin, you will be able to add on different kind of things that you have to add using different kinds of plugin so let's see what you can add like a template library or a special page for sale pages like that so you can directly create using this shop lender plugin because it have 10 plus modules for gutenberg and elementor so let's see how it works so there are two methods to install it in your wordpress website either you can download it from this link go to the plugin and click on add new and either you can upload the plugin file that you have downloaded just now or you can search in from here shop Lenter. and it will show up here this one you have to click on install now and after installing you have to click on activate so after activation of the plugin you will see this page so there are some free extensions that it is showing this just table creates the product table and this WooCommerce wholesale price and WooCommerce B2B store solution so either if you want to use them you can directly click on install now and it will activate automatically so let's move on to its general so here you will see the documentation page and a video tutorial so how to use this plugin you will get to know it and next is WooCommerce templates so here you can enable or disable WooCommerce templates so if you want to download a template you can go to template library on your left side window under shop lenter you will see a template library if you click on it you will see all kind of templates options like for card product details home shop so if you want to get a template you simply have to click on it and then select import so these are all pro templates so to use them you have to buy its pro package so its pricing is as follows so this is its pricing plus allied agency and bundle so this plugin you can use it for free also the basic template you can directly import it from here and there are two methods import to library or import to builder so i'll go with import to library and then now if you click on edit template it will open up the editorial page elementor page So now here on this page you will see the product page and here on your left side window these are all the things that are available from your pool enter or shop enter plugin. So these are all the add-ons that you get after installing different kind of plugins like a special day offer plugin or a ad banner plugin or a category plugin product accordion and plugin breadcrumbs plugin so all of this you can directly get by installing shop lenter and you can directly drag and drop them to use it like call for price option you can drop it on the 
product page so let's see how you can do it all first we will go back to our menu and here in template now you can see the two templates one template and you can choose single product template product shop page template uh, different kinds of templates or leave it to default so these are our pro options now next is gutenberg so these are all gutenberg blocks that will be available on gutenberg and elementor also like promo banner image maker brand logo pack archive title you can turn it on and off from here and next is elements so these are all the elements that are available you can simply turn it off from here these are all the modules like rename the label sales notification so this gives the notification of each sale so it will if you turn it on and anyone purchases a product then the notification will be shown in here so that the new buyer or the new visitor to your site gets a reassurance that your site is getting used and they can buy it with the more trust you can change the positions of this notification also you can just leave all the settings to default and click on save changes now it will already show it you can set it to manually also or you can show it to real time you can click on flash sale countdown so it will show a countdown on your website so these are all the things that you can do with a different plugin but using this you do not have to install different kinds of plugin it has the package in it you have to add the sale item give the event a name you have to click on valid from and valid to and you can apply this on all product you can click on the product that you want to exclude from here like shares you can click on discount value how much discount you want on them and this is what it will show up hurry up offer ends in this much times like that and here is the position of the countdown add to cart before and now if you click on changes so if i go to my shop page so here if you click on any product now it will show you how many time the offer ends and the message will be shown here hurry up offer ends in 20 hours 31 minute you can turn on compare so that user can compare different items you can turn on wish list so that user can wish list the item do not have to add to cart directly you can turn on variation swatches all of these things and these are all the pro features in elements also like an elementor if you want to add any element directly you can do it by going to shop lender or wool enter add-ons and now if i want to add like a faq I can get it below my product archive 
simply right here. So now I will have my FAQ right here. And these are all the FAQs and you can edit the content from here. So this is simply you can add in FAQs. You do not have to install a different plugin for this also. So there are many other things that you can do using shop letter. So this is what you can do with this wool enter plugin. Thank you for watching. That's it for today. Hit the like button if you like this video and subscribe to Educate WordPress.